last couple days have been great. Our numbers were up again with our sheep and our goats on Friday night. We had an excellent crowd. We appreciate Brother Fixico coming and doing us an invocation in the creek, which was outstanding. We appreciate the royalty being here, which was new for us. And so we were really tickled to have them at that time. Um, Today, we, of course, with the addition of the hog show, uh, the breeding guilt show, we've had that many more. So we added a third day so we could do the cattle on Sunday afternoon. And I'm not a person that likes to do on Sunday, but it just kind of, we had to do something there. So, And we're looking for a really big turnout on our cattle tomorrow. I've had a lot of phone calls, so we're just real excited. It's been really good. Okay, so right now they're bringing in all the winners from every commercial class, and so there are different ages in through here. They show by age group in each class. So they bring the winners for basically the best of each age. They bring them out here and show them against each other, and then they'll get a champion commercial heifer, which wins that breed. Then they'll bring all of the winners of the other breeds in to the ring, and they'll show for the overall best heifer. So that's what they're getting ready to do now. Last night we had about 150 combined sheep and goats, which is about 20 more than what we've had in the past. Our hog numbers this year are right at three, a little better than 300, so that was right where we were at last year. Tomorrow with the cattle, I really look for us to have numbers that are bigger. You know, it's going to be pretty weather. There's nothing going on on the Sunday afternoon. People are going to look to get out, so I really look for it to be bigger. Yeah. Uh -huh.